Thank you for joining us today for this episode of the Spectrum Report. We have a ton of stuff to talk about today, so I hope we make it through in a reasonable amount of time. Uh, this episode, as all episodes of the Spectrum Report, is brought to you by Neural Balance with Anandanol. Anandanol is a patented herbal mineral vitamin blend that was created by a doctor and a pharmacist to help their own families. If you'd like to learn more about it, head to neuralbalance.com and click on the how it works tab that'll uh, teach you a little more information about it what's in it how it works how it was created and all of that good stuff if you want to keep up to date with promos and shows and different things like that that we have going on head over to facebook and like and follow us there and if you're a parent or caregiver and you would like to receive tips and feedback from other parents and caregivers search neural balance support group on facebook and ask to join you can learn a lot of stuff about us by just simply going to Google, checking us out on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, Twitter, Periscope now, and uh, also we podcast. So check, uh, search for The Spectrum Report on your favorite podcast app. Now, Instagram and YouTube, in, actually Instagram and Facebook, we're running a contest coming up that we'll be talking about uh, here while, I'm, while I have Anne on in the show we'll be talking about the uh, instagram and the facebook contest so keep an eye out for that but then also if you're watching on youtube right now we're going to have a giveaway and i'm super excited about it because it includes over 400 dollars of autism approved products really good clean products so the the today's giveaway will be part of our comment and enter to win feature so we'll tell a, a little bit more about tell you a little bit more about that later but that is only if you're watching on youtube so if you're watching on facebook you may have already missed it because this is a this is a feature that we do on YouTube. So if you're watching on Facebook, you're going to get some great content today. But you want to head over to YouTube and subscribe to our channel there so that you will be able to enter to win every Thursday night, 930 Eastern Standard Time, uh, 930 p.m. that is. All right. So. Today's show, I, I'm pretty excited about. I, I know the holidays are, are super tough. Um, there's just so many concerns. Travel, sensory, food, uh, all this new stuff that people are just sticking in your face and, and trying to sell you and feed your children and all of that stuff. So we have a lot of stuff that we want to talk about today. Some, some good alternatives that we found for the sweets and that type of thing. And some pretty cool stuff that we found too um, for holiday events and things that are more sensory friendly. So if you're wondering about some things to do for the holidays or maybe some good treats to avoid the red dye and things like that, I think you might be interested in today's show. And of course you wanna stick around till the end because if you're watching on YouTube, we're going to tell you how to win over $400 worth of great products today. So without further ado, I would like to welcome my partner in crime, my <laughs> cohort, my co-host, Ann Reisner. How are you doing today? Good, good. I'm good. not going to say anything is good because, you know, it's all bad. So that way I don't jinx myself like I did last time. <laughs> uh, that, but that was fun. And I edited it out. So it looked fine. It was not a big deal. Uh, but it was a lot of fun. But it's funny because we were just talking, to, what, five minutes ago and yeah. you were all out of breath and everything. It's it's this. Now, everybody, you know, if you're watching, you really got to appreciate what Anne's doing for us here. Because I wanted to have a voice from the community, somebody who's dealing with these things, struggling with these things things, finding solutions and all of that. So that's why I said, you know, it'd be really cool to have Anne co-host this Thursday night show. Uh, but she's doing it in between naps and homeschooling and yes. uh, rugrat corralling. Mm -hmm. if, uh, is that politically correct? Boys. Can I say so, that? I mean, yes. uh, is that okay? All, okay. Yes, I'm okay. Uh, so, I'm not 
Right, right. So while you're doing all this, then you you run up to the to your husband's office and and grace yeah, us with your he's presence. Got me. So he's got me all you. set up. So he's like, you literally just turn it on. I'm like, thank you. All right, good, good. <laughs> well, we appreciate you being here. So now, one of the things that that I'm excited about, we're and we're going to talk about this later on, is the contest that we have going on Instagram and yes. Facebook. Yes. And w- you know, we were talking about some of the challenges that the holidays present and you know a a lot of us look at the holidays we just can't wait there's going to be good food and good cheer and all these great things happening on which is what you want i mean that is what your goal is yeah for everybody but then i you know i realized hey it's a whole different world for some folks so that was something we started talking about some alternatives alternative events alternative things that you can attend and alternative foods and and candy and and stuff like that i mean a lot of like we have food allergies and food sensitivities. So food, we're at the point where we're like, can we do any holiday without it being surrounded by food? I mean, Mm, there's a, there's, there's exactly, exactly. (laughs) And everybody's like, you're crazy. So, I mean, you have the aspect of some of our family is like, well, I guess we'll kind of do it this day at maybe around this time. And I'm like, people, I have to plan. I have to shop. I have to get this stuff food prepped. I have to get it packed and my children still alive and in the car. Right. So the be- the biggest thing I've told people is I'm like, just let me know, like, give me time, give me at least 24 to 48 hours when you know what's going on. Let me know if you know what food you're going to have, because that's the other thing, too. Our oldest understands he knows that stuff's going to hurt his stomach. He won't. Our middle guy who's more severe doesn't. He sees a cookie. He's going to take that cookie. Mm, he doesn't right. understand that. Hey, that's going to make me you're gonna pay horribly for that. sick. Yeah, right. we all pay for it, really. Yeah, <laughs> I right. mean, when he's not sleeping, nobody's sleeping is how it feels. So it's, it's a lot of it is um, finding options, but it's nice now. I mean, six years ago when we started this stuff with him, especially, there were not as many options of, hey, I can just run in the store, grab this, you know, Enjoy Life. I love Enjoy Life brand and Cybels. Their cookies are amazing. So it's like, oh, crap, something quick's happening, you know, with a bunch of family. Let's go. We can run in and grab this. And it's, it's much nicer to not have to cook every single thing sometimes. Right, right. Um, but then there's the candy option. And I have friends, their kids are in school and they've got candy everywhere. And it's like if your kid can't have red dye, which ours turns into the Hulk, all of our children turn into the Hulk. My boys are week. not on the spectrum. And they, when they were younger, red dye would throw them for a loop. My my younger one, he's 14 now, he'll be 15 this month. He um, I, he could eat just a sucker, a dum dum, mm-hmm. a red dum mm-hmm. dum. Yep. And not only did he get hyper, but he would get aggressive. I mean, I would. Yep. Lo- I'm like, what is your deal? Like, just angry, hard to get along with, over yeah. one sucker. And yep. again, that's one of the things. Like we talked our last show, we did the full moon, and yeah. I, I a lot. Of, I have to confess, being doing this has really opened my eyes to a lot of things because I would hear other parents say. Oh, red dye, red dye. And I'm like, come on. But then I started taking notes of the changes. Yeah, it's not that big of a deal. That's why one of the jokes I always say, because we we, uh, color our drink powder with beet powder yeah. that's yeah. what gives it the red yes and i, and I was joking you i'm like uh yeah well i didn't want to be one of those companies yeah. that said man this is a great product it works great so what's a little red dye yeah no there's that, so many it there's so many and much. i'm like come yeah. on it doesn't take yeah. much to really throw them for a loop so i can just imagine a kid who's super sensitive or on the spectrum yeah. already have has struggles uh, that and then taking in the red dye, I just yep. can't see that being a good thing. Felix, so. dyes actually for our guy usually make him instantly like sick. Like mm. we're usually by midnight or the next day, he is physically getting sick. Like he has the flu for a day. Like his body just utterly rejects it, and right. it's just not fun. We had one uh, birthday party with friends earlier in the year. They had done everything clean, and she was like, "Well, the cake has I can't remember. I think it was blue and red dye or something. Just a little. Just and you know, he was. We didn't have the choice to have our own at that time because she's like, "Oh, the cake will be clean." So I'm like, "Oh, the cake's gonna be clean. Oh crap, it's not clean. We're right. stuck here. Whatever." So we let him have a little. Yeah. And I'm like, okay, I'm just going to make cake. Wherever we're going, I'm bringing back up cake in the trunk. <laughs> well, and that was something I, th- I was thinking about when we were talking. I mean, you homeschool, so this isn't as yes. much of a concern. But if you have a child on the spectrum or or a child who is sensitive to dyes yeah. and has food yeah. allergies, you have to really plan ahead if they go to school yes. or if it's a church event or well, and it's going – 
all of December is oh, yeah. well, parties every, at school, parties at church, the, yeah. parties here, parties there. And so it's like if you don't almost, have that communication with your teacher, like, hey, you got to give me notice. Like, let me know what snacks so you're So you doing. can send something yes, in. Yes, exactly. And then <clears throat> the teacher has to try to help yeah. limit what he's getting and, yes. and get what, nice what's good crafts, for him. It's not food. That's what we joke right. about. My friends that have kids in public school, they're like, can we please have one craft item that's not, because they're like, oh, let's put a snowman out of marshmallows. Oh, let's do this. And it's like when you have a yeah. kid, I mean, and it's also just the sugar factor. The sugar factor for us, my go guys will have headaches and then they're stimming more and then they're raging more. And it's like, they don't even have to have dye, just that much sugar. And it's like Christmas. That's the time they get. Honestly, they probably get more sugar Constant. in the two weeks of Christmas stuff than they do the whole year. Yeah. I mean, because it is it is just nuts. And then we have January. Is, oh, you know, okay. we should do a show on Candida cleanse in January. Yes, we should. Because, <laughs> I mean, really, January is like, okay, let's get People our People are feeding it back, all December. Feeding back that to Candida. Well, and, and then, but then you have sickness. When you have sugar, I think it is sugar knocks down the immune system for four straight hours. Mm. So if you load yourself up with sugar and you're around, hey, we're going to be around, you know, 50 people today. Guarantee for us, it's a guarantee someone's going to get sick. And it's so like what do you years do? What, what, well, what do you do in the case? So like okay, with the with the things that – so you came and said, hey, I want to do a giveaway. I want to do a yes. gift basket yes. contest with a giveaway. And we started talking about some of the challenges that come with – the holidays and yeah. that was one thing candy right yes. so candy yes. candy and candy they're all red dye yeah and it's almost them. you you want to let them indulge a little bit yes. something so this you is almost their look for the lesser the least evil yeah. thing yeah. so you 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 found some stuff that that I'm excited about because it's yeah. cool things that we can give away but it, and it, and there is some sugar in some of it there is and it's low that's what's nice like this brand I love and Yum Earth Yum Earth yeah candy These cane are their, pops their, those their are candy yummy. cane suckers um, we also like they their were candy not cane. easy to find either the candy all the canes, people like us are like ordering this stuff in right, November like so we're gonna need so these. what is it diff what's different so let me see it again Yum Yummy Earth Yum, Yum Earth, Earth. Okay. Can I get it? I'm so, sorry. Yes. So, so the ingredients what? are cane sugar, brown rice syrup, peppermint, beet juice extract, and then it's got red cabbage extract and turmeric. That's it. Okay. Okay. And you've so got a yummy sucker. Color it's peppermint. Yep. You've got, and I think the turmeric is probably the green because they have a green one and a red right. one. Right. Right. But they also do candy canes, and their candy canes, they taste like, oh. And they were sold out. I wish they I were, I know, because you were like, I'm not paying two months ago to buy a bunch. bunch. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Amazon. Well, I couldn't even that. find them that would have got here in time. Yeah, they I know. were saying, not... um, order now for shipping mid December, something I like that. I found them at Target. So... I oh really? Target. Oh good. And I got good. Them, so yeah. I should have got some. <laughs> so yeah. So well, it, so the red dye, I I think. It, it's been my observation, at least, that when you mix it, so the sugar does gives them some yep, energy, the makes them a little hyper. Yep. But then when you add that to the red dye or other preservatives or colors or things like that, it tends to really be it, a much it has, bigger it thing. Amplifies. So it, I I noticed that they have a brown rice syrup yes. there, so that sweetens a little bit. So they're not and having the cane sugar, just right. simple cane sugar. Because what is it uh, in three? So there's about four grams of sugar per sucker. But when okay. you look at like a regular sucker, it's like 12 to 15. At oh, least wow. from the ones like we, we've looked at. Right. Just because I was the like, I'm curious. Yeah, and plus the all the dyes. Preservatives and, and they a lot usually of things have high can... fructose corn syrup, which right. is like, oh, uh, garbage. Yeah. yeah. So it's just like, hey, yum earth. I love their stuff. They have awesome stuff for every holiday. I love their Easter stuff because they get like jelly beans and yummy things like that. So it's like our kids can enjoy. You know, it's like they don't have to stand out as much, you know, because right. like my oldest is starting to understand. He's like, well, we don't do things like everybody else. And I'm like, well, right. that's okay. But look, this is your special thing, you know, where our middle guy's like, hey, they got candy. I just want candy. I don't I care. Like, like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's candy because he snuck in here and was like, candy. <laughs> right. Well, even in your case, you homeschool, but you're yeah. still there's parties it's, to go yeah, to and people family. visiting yep. and people are sending you stuff and yep. everybody means stockings. well they yeah they parents all always are like what can we put in stockings and i'm like let me just send the candy to you like don't I, you know yeah. i remember when i was a kid my i got this every year and i loved it this giant 
like honking candy cane. It was like a billy club. Oh, no. You remember? You, did oh, you get I those? Remember. You, oh, yeah, no, yeah. I couldn't stand them. I did like the giant pixie sticks. Just oh, no. See, I love that thing. Sugar and I would it. gnaw on it for like the next two days. But, and Give that, me a that giant. was junk. Well, I, I don't know. When I was a kid. Kiss, I ate one that was like the size of my right, face one time. Right. Those are good too. <laughs> But that's but horrible for you. That's oh the yeah thing. oh yeah. It was so awful. what did you find besides the yum so earth? Then, did you find other enjoy candy? Enjoy life. I love their little chocolate packs, and they had they had okay. four different flavors. This is just the plain dark chocolate that my kids like. But they have like a rice milk chocolate, so it's a little bit lighter chocolate. Right. And then they have like a crunch one, which it's little rice chips in it, which it is a nice little crunch, which my right. kids were like, um, we like it, but we can eat more of these. So. Right. <laughs> And then, oh, okay, my grandmother used to make homemade caramels, and they were amazing. And no matter how much my mom and I try, not going to happen. It. You can't make grandma's caramels. These are really close, though. And those and are it, coconut, coconut yeah, milk. Yeah, they're coconut milk. Yes, wow. I love them, and I have eaten whole bags by myself. <laughs> 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 so, like, yeah, get these. Honestly, we've done fun stuff with, like, melting chocolate and caramel. Mm, oh, yes. yeah. 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 I'm dairy so, free, so I mean, in, when you find the good stuff, you, you got have to, it all. yeah, you got to take advantage. What, and then so, yummers what are again the? Oh, the gummies, gummies, yeah, they're cute little like snowflakes and little fun Christmas ones. Oh, that's cute. I was, that's too, cute. I was so, super excited to find those. Now, all the stuff that you got, the what we just showed, plus other stuff, um, you you came to me with an idea. You said I want to do a giveaway. I want to do a contest. So. Uh, to be honest with you, I say, I turned you and David loose on it, and I haven't paid much attention in, except for filling the wish list that you sent me on Amazon. <laughs> so what other products did you get in there? Um, how many baskets are you making, and how are you guys giving six, this stuff away? We have wow, six baskets. Okay, good. Six baskets. Because we'll have Neural Balance, and then we will have um, Mega Spore Biotics, which are my absolute favorite probiotics on the planet. Right. They, the thing I love about them is some kids do not handle probiotics well. Even right. adults, some strains bug people. Well, these are specifically spore-based strains of probiotics. So they go in and they strictly just feed the good strains already in the digestive tract. Okay. So you don't really, and you have kids like that have SIBO and things like that. They can't take regular strains of probiotics, but this comes in and just supports the good. I love that. <laughs> um, and so you have to start slow. That's the big thing. You have to go really slow because they're really effective. Um, but then we have our favorite. Um, it's Naturello. And it is, they have gummy, organic, whole food multivitamins for kids. Oh, wow. We were That's struggling awesome. really hard to get our kids up. And we were doing the methylated, all these good forms, and they weren't working. And our kids were like, these taste horrible. Right. <laughs> and it was becoming a bigger battle. And I'm like, okay, what can we do? And I happened to find these on a simple search. And was like, oh, this is a fairly new company. Yeah, they're amazing. They have adult gummies, too, for um, adult people that want gummies. Oh, They've nice. got a lot of good stuff. So they sent us a bunch. And I'm super excited about their whole um, – it's a whole food greens mix. That's organic, clean. I'm super excited. Okay. Um, and then we have um, some really awesome blends of essential oils from Plant Therapy. They sent us their, like, immune kids blend. And let me think. One, two, three, four. What was the other one? I, I can't remember. count right now. <laughs> You're like, I don't know. I put you on the spot. Um, one, two, three. What is it? Oh, 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 duh. Kaliana. Kaliana's story is really awesome. She's an amazing woman. And her and her daughter run this company now. She does, um, they are essential oils and flower essence sprays. They have sprays and drink mixes. And huh. she sent us a giant kit of hers. It's called their Fix, I think it's the Fix Me kit. And okay. it's eight to nine bottles of their sprays oh, wow. and you spritz cool. them in the air. They're amazing for my kids. They're calm and stress relief one. I think right. It's, yeah. Stress relief. Oh, I love them. I could honestly wear all of these all the time. I love them. Um, so and yes. that's great. Cause I know a lot of people, they just can't stand, uh, you know, perfumes or things yeah. like that. So that sounds like a good alternative. Yeah. And I, she, she, she laughs that she wears her sprays more like a perfume, but they right. also help her mood and help her with whatever she's got going on that day. She's like, Hey, she has one that's confidence, which I've really enjoyed. Cause I'm like, when I'm just like, yeah. and I have to go out and like do something big. I'm like, okay, I need some help here. Like, right. oh. and they all smell so nice. Like even my husband, he can't stand perfumes. Neither of us do anything really scented. And he's like, you know, these smell really good. And my oh, boys good. are like, I like these. 
So yeah, they'll they'll try to just like sneak and spray them all day. And I'm like, right. okay, they're not air fresheners for the house, but they're like, I like. But it. I need so, to be calm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's Felix. I need it. I need it. Um, but yeah, so those are, I believe, those are all of them, right? So you 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 actually found so what you did. So what we wanted to do was we wanted to give away cool baskets, cool prizes, yes. Yes. but useful things, not just yeah. You yeah, know, I only don't give some candy junk. or whatever, it, right? So, I mean, it's Christmas, so I mean, we're gonna most likely get some junk from people. So I'm like, I want right. to give you useful things that you can use for yourself or your kids, you know, through the holidays. Even I mean, right. that's what's really nice is some of these companies went big with their what they were willing to give away. So well, and that's what was cool. All these companies donated it, right? Yeah. The only think the they only thing like, we had to buy was it. some of the candy, just because it was harder to find. But yeah, and the I was other like, the products, which are really the valuable part yes. of it. They yeah. were all donated. You told them oh, what yeah. we wanted to do and who yeah. would be receiving it, and they donated. Yeah. That's awesome. That was so. the other thing. Um, Generation Mindful gave us a positive parenting course. Oh, Co wow. Coupon code. I okay. love their stuff. It's really, really neat, and it's helped my kids tremendously on balancing emotions and learning what you're feeling and connecting that with a certain emotion. Rather than just raging, we now have, okay, mama, I'm feeling red. I'm mad. I need help doing this or I need to take some breaths and calm down. They That's what I liked so about nice their things. stuff is oh, like I, I was it. looking when you were telling me about them, then I started looking through the um, consumables and stuff yeah. that they have. Oh, I love and it. it. It was really cool because it's very simple, but it's engaging. Yes. Uh, and they do and stuff for like different ages. So you can get one kit and they're like, here's how you can use it for a young kid. Here's how you can right. use it for a bigger kid. Yes. we. Oh, I love their stuff. They and sometimes stuff some of those – um, applications or approaches, yeah. they can get kind of, I don't know, a little wonky, weird or whatever. And or they just don't... not on the level. Like with our, my kids, I have one who's like way over here. They're, they're just different in how they understand things. So it's like right. having something that can easily go on the plane for both of them to get and enjoy. And I right. mean, we've made it kind of like a calm time together or we all sit down and do it. It's so much nicer than having to be like, okay, sorry. All right, so gonna <laughs> you're gonna sneeze. Okay. Uh -oh. I thought it was. Oh, so see, I hope I never sneeze during a show because I'm a four sneezer, <laughs> and it's loud too. Like it's a big, violent thing. It's it's a mess. Oh, now your eyes are water, and that's hilarious. A day in the life of Van Reisner, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, we're okay. keeping it real here. Is what we're doing. <laughs> <laughs> I can't be fake. I'm sorry. If I, yeah, that's good. Yeah, can't do it. But um, I okay. I love it. So so the we have six baskets. Yes. There'll be I'm a so little excited. bit of candy and Christmassy yes. treats in each yes. one of them. That's what that's yes. about. But each basket will be one of the things that you spoke about today. Yes. And yep. that's good. That's awesome because they're all great prizes. So when and we've we, talked of getting reaching out to them again and having them come on the show and talk too. Because well, and that's what I was going to say. Were awesome. Just yeah, when I, was like, I would. Hey, this I definitely. Is who we are. Yeah, yeah, definitely want to interview some of them. And then we can highlight the product more, you yeah. know, in, uh, after the holidays. Right now, we want to do these things to be fun and give some stuff away. So that is Instagram and Facebook. And you're taking, you have a photographer coming. You're putting yes. everything together. You're she's so awesome. sweet. Like, you, you guys don't even know. She's an autism mom. So I was like, hey, can we do this? And she's like, yeah, let's go for it. So right. Like, and, and it's not good enough. You're just not sending people a box of stuff. Like, you want a no, basket, no. make it's it cute. Look nice. I love it. Yes. And they've got, nice. and they're getting the whole thing. They're not just getting the product, they're getting the whole thing because, you know, I'm a woman. This is how we do this. Right. That's nice. So <laughs> it'll look great. Voice on the and boxes. People will love it. Yeah. So, and that, yeah, that's what I was going to say. The candy. <laughs> now, the candy almost didn't make it to today's show, right? The one box. So, I, yes. we were on the phone, I think, last week <laughs> I, after our last show, and we were planning this show, and then you screech, and, you, and you're like, ah, hold on, and I hear clunk your phone. <laughs> And then I hear you wrestling with somebody in the background. So what the, what, what happened? So there? I seen the box get delivered. So I was like, okay, I'm not going out there. I figured it was the box of the suckers. I'm like, right. nobody's. if I bring this box in, my kids are like, boxes have presents or food in them. So they're oh. like, we got to get it. So I'm like, I'm going to bring it in. My husband, on the other hand, we had someplace to go to. So he's like, oh, I'll bring this in and get the kids in the car. No. <laughs> 
<laughs> no, they like go crazy. And I'm like, no, that's the box. He's like, what box? And I'm like trying to spell it out, which I'm like, dumb. My oldest is like, that's candy. And I'm like, crap, oh. you can spell. <laughs> <laughs> and so we're like checking this box around and like getting it. He's like, I'm like, just take it anywhere. And he's like, I'm locking it in the office. So he's running up, locking it in the office. And I'm getting the kids in the car, and they're not like, we need to see the box. And I'm like, it's gone. It's, it's <laughs> That's nothing. Hilarious. I'm like, That's hilarious. And then today, More stuff was delivered today, by the way. Oh, yes, yes. I know. Yeah. I ran out okay, and got yeah. it. Because <laughs> <laughs> I was like, if they see these, they're going to go into them. Um, but no, today, like, we were getting all ready. And I'm like, everything's going okay. And then the door creaks open, and my little one just goes, candy. Because I oh. set out on the desk. Right. <laughs> so, so he's we can not talk like, about it. That, so he I was, gets fun. He was good, good, though. Yeah, he was, he was good. He, I told he him left you alone. one. There you yeah. go. Yeah. So, well, we'll so the, these candy, they don't affect them as much as the others because they don't have they'll the red have, dye and they they'll have less get sugar. a little. I mean, honestly, it's more so they'll get a little sugar buzz, but it's right. like, okay. But with it being so small, we can run it off normally. Like, okay, right. we're going to have candy. Now we're going to do something super active, run it off, and then they'll chill out. And I usually I do, do like, like that. An, an Epsom salt bath in the night. That always helps them just totally calm down. And that's really. For, especially in the holidays, that's an every night thing. When we come home from anywhere, it's an Epsom salt bath and everybody just calms down and it that's really good. helps them because it helps detox a little bit too. So it's right. just like this overall calming and support. And you're going to love this product I found at the trade show. I, so I just went to a trade show last Saturday, natural products industry trade show. And you've heard of Redmond salt. Yes. Right. Okay. Yes. So they have a salt mineral bath packet <gasps> thing now yeah yeah it looked really oh, yes. cool you so gotta send me this stuff. i i got some information from them i w what i was trying to do is find other products that we could do shows about yeah. or yeah. that we could maybe even sell or offer or highlight yeah. just so that it would help people out and I, that was really cool because that I company's been around forever that do um magnesium flakes with their child struggles so much with absorbing magnesium and when right. your whole system needs it i mean every cell uses magnesium right and um they'll do magnesium flakes in a bath and they're like it gets my kids levels up and they stay and that's just like two or three times a week that's what they do so it Sometimes for some kids, avoiding the gut, especially if there's leaky gut issues, they can get better things at topical and in the bath. So right, right. it's a nice idea. Yeah. Yeah. yeah especially so, doing minerals. That's awesome. So one of the other things we were talking about was I was surprised at how many now people are starting to understand. Yeah when it comes to holidays and things like that, that they need to make some accommodations for the, those who struggle with sensory issues. Yeah. Uh, now, something that's been going on for years, I think is cool. AMC movie theaters do it. I yeah. think other chains do it too. They actually have a sensory sensitive a viewing of certain yes. movies yes. where they, they only dim the lights halfway instead of yep. all the way off. The volume is much lower. You can bring in food. Oh my gosh. Yes. I bet that's the biggest thing. Thing, Honestly, you can bring for in us, food, if bring you're going to be there food. for a while, we have to have food. I mean, we, we, well, we just, and you can't boys, have, there's absolutely and nothing you're not allowed there. To do it. Yeah, no, right, for never, you. never. I mean, so, as a teenager, I snuck my fair share of snacks in a movie theater, but, <laughs> right. but, but, no, but when you have a kid. We're, not, we're, only, <laughs> we're only saying that's that's a good thing, though, when they allow it. But what, but being able to bring your own food in, I think, is, yeah. is paramount because it, it's not just about the money, but it's about having snacks for your kids that yes. they can and enjoy yes, while yes. they're watching the movie. Because there's there's good popcorn that you can get. There's good, like you saw, mm, some candy. Butter. Well, butter. It, they put uh, that butter, butter on that popcorn. Mm -mm, not no, well, that's people. what I mean. There's good popcorn that <laughs> oh, you yeah, can bring yes, in, yes. right? You can pop and it at home with friend, coconut oil. A, yeah. She has a small theater actually near them that they've called and been like, look, our kid has food allergies. Can we bring our own stuff? And they're like, yeah, just bring it to the desk so we know that that's the situation. And so since it's a small, nice, like close little theater to them, they can take their kids and they go to the movies with their kids and it's oh, no big good. deal. So yeah, it's nice great. doing that. Um, a cool theater, a big theater for us. I was so shocked, and I've debated on doing it. Um, we found out that a big theater is doing a Nutcracker for kids or you adults that, on the sensory you were, spectrum. Yeah, you were you want to take Ezra, but you were kind of concerned about. I don't do think, think Felix could do it just because right. it's a long show. I mean, right. when I went a few years ago, my husband and I went. Actually, a few years. It was before we had kids. Um, <laughs> so like 10 years ago, yeah, right. Um, That's a whole we different went, life, it isn't like, it? When you look back before children, BC, before I'm children, like, look, I didn't have so many wrinkles on my face. <laughs> I don't have so many bags under my eyes. And you could just do whatever you wanted whenever yeah, you wanted. Just, hey, let's go. 
let's go. And really, right. that was actually how it was when we just had one. When autism came in, that changed everything. Right, it right. always changes everything. But yeah, we were thinking our oldest could possibly do it. And they like they went down this whole long list. They're like, one, you can bring food, which they are. You're never allowed to have food outside of their one area, um, food court style area. Right. And um, well, I guess it's a cafe because it's all like. So is this a sensory friendly yes, airing? Completely. Oh, awesome. Nutcracker. Yeah. yeah. And they're um, the they're dimming. the. They're actually not dimming the lights. They're having lights on because it gets dark in there. I mean, it is like right. you can't see your hand pitch black for a lot of their performances. They're having all the sound, like 35 to 40% reduced. They're not okay. going to do any of the loud, like, bangs or flashing Suddens, lights or anything right, like that. Right. Um, they're going to have all the exits lit up, and anyone can exit or leave at any time. Um, they're going to have a lot of ushers that are coming in and out. So if you need anything, you can instantly get somebody to help. And I was just, like, blown away. This is the first time I've ever seen that they've done that. And I asked a few friends that, are, that go there a lot, and they're like, we've never heard of them doing that. And all the seats that are available, it's only like, I think it was like less than 50 or around 50. So it, this is a massive theater of the fit hundreds. They're like, no, we're doing it small. All the seats are like spaced out. So you can have three or four people here and then there's a space. So you're not cramming oh, cool. everybody in. Right, right. I mean, they just really, really thought everything through. So I'm not sure. It all depends on husband's college schedule oh. <laughs> if he's done yet or not. Because that was our thing. I'm like, crap, I think that's Luigi's final. The life of I the perpetual student. One more year, man. One more yeah, year. One more year. Uh, uh, but that's why he's like, it's my senior year. So everything's more like, uh. yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, that, it's cool. They do that. I didn't realize when you were talking about the Nutcracker performance that it yeah. was also um, sensory sensitive. Yeah. And I was, I was surprised and happy to see. So when we were talking about the show, um, I knew that they were a couple things because I've, I've seen it on yeah, the news yeah. that we're doing it but so I googled um, a couple different things like uh, sensory holiday near me yeah, yeah. sensory sensitive Christmas sensor 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 sensory <laughs> sensitive um, holiday show yeah. things like that and I was surprised some of the major symphonies even yeah Boston Pops yeah. and, and yeah. Um, Philadelphia Symphony and, and a lot of real big symphonies actually did um, sensory sensitive events, whole thing. Yeah. So yeah. the lights, like I said, they were only dimmed about halfway, yep. so it wasn't too dark. The volume was at a lower pace, 35, level, 40%, yeah. like you said, lower level. Um, and then th th you mentioned, which I th think is great, is there's not as many people. They let you spread yes. out. And again, yes. almost all of them had these common themes, which were yeah. awesome. Yeah. And uh, uh, the food, bring, being able to bring your food, that was food also a common theme. Water. Yeah. You know, if you're and kids, and I think guys, it's great. Yeah. Yeah, I think it's great because for for a lot of reasons. I mean, it costs a lot to have a kid on the spectrum. It it, it, it takes its thing, toll. You know, I was blown away. This cost is like a fourth of what they charge regular. See, tickets. and that's great in the daytime. So you're not going to be out on the busy street at night. It's in the middle of the day, and I'm like, they. Oh, I was so shocked. Yeah, cost everything. I'm like, these people get it. Like they've had enough people that are probably like, we would love for our kids to enjoy something like this, and even adults. Right. I mean, anybody. Music, it's the Nutcracker. I mean, it's my favorite right, ballet. Ever. Right. But, you know, it's like to be able to enjoy that and share that with your kid, that I think is huge and make it actually reasonable and possible for families to do that. I'm, right. I'm like, even if we don't go, I feel like I need to write them a thank you note. Like, it's right. just so nice to know that they're doing that. So I'm I like, hope you guys can go because it's a, what we, we did a few blogs in the past. We have, I think, two or three blogs about travel. And yes. I, I was so happy to see some of the. There are cruise lines, hotels, mm -hmm. airlines. There are a lot of folks now who are accommodating special needs families, um, sensory issues, autism, ADHD, and all of that, and really do, going out of their way to create spaces yeah. for these families for, so that they can just come and enjoy. Like and we not... last time, compassion. When yes. you can show compassion for everyone, especially families that struggle with these things, Right. you can... It's a game changer. You're playing downstairs for four minutes? Yes, and I'm waiting for you. Oh, you're waiting for me to get done? I'm almost done, my love, okay. Um, maybe five. five Her kids five. are so cute. But thanks to YouTube, we can't show them. <laughs> when I, listen, when I'm done, you can come talk to him, okay? 
I don't even think I'm gonna edit this. It's too, it's too cute. He's trying to wander over and get the guitar. He's like the guitar. I'm not the guitar. Okay. Okay. Well, you want to take that downstairs? You'll take two. So okay. we can still hear you, but I took you out. So. Because <laughs> th this is how the, the new YouTube stuff. I um, well, I get which it. with good reason. I yeah, I do get yeah. it. But they, as always, you know, they they go from almost no yeah. oversight to an iron fist. Uh oh. Okay, no. He he took these foam things for the wall. He wanted to take two. He loves to just steal them. Well, I think he's using them to slide down the stairs. Oh, that's funny. That <laughs> is so I think funny. He, he just hit the wall, and I'm like. No <laughs> like, I just he's like it's just a sensory thing. I just want to, you know. Yeah. Oh, thunk, yeah. thunk, <laughs> that's hilarious. Them, them having these stairs and I love how padded our stairs are. They just fly and I thought, I'm gonna That's it. funny. Well, you know what I think I'm going to do? I'm going to I'll probably wrap up your section cuz I uh, you you've helped us out. You told us about the the cool um stuff that that I wanted to get across for holiday foods and yeah. stuff like that because it sounds like they're going to come back and they're going to want your attention again. He and now we've food droned food. on now for about 36 minutes, so and he wants he wants you and his, his snack. So I Oh, so I'll time. finish and then I'll talk yeah. to him yeah. a little bit too. Thanks so yeah, so, well, I, I hope you guys can go. I mean, and here's the thing. If you're a family looking for something to do and you're concerned about these, you know, the, the sensory, a lot of companies, a lot of events, a lot of travel, a lot of, you know, people are really starting to become more compassionate well, and, the more you reach and accommodating. Out, like you have to yeah. let them know, hey, we would like to do this, or we know other people that would like to do this. The more they know that there's a group needing this, right. I think that's when they're like, okay, we have had a lot of people ask about this. Now we'll actually try to implement it. Right. And I think that's what makes a big difference is they need to know. They need to know if you want to do this, let them know, hey, could we ever do, you know, some type of sensory event, you know, or whatever. Right. And, and you yeah. might be surprised to find what's already happening in your community yeah. because we I was shocked with this. We have a, a business called Hangar Fifteen. It's one of those trampoline, you yeah. know, places. Yeah. And they have a sensory sensitive time. The lights yeah. are on full, the music oh, yeah. is much lower. It's they can blow off some steam. Um, not have to worry about, yeah. you know, too much sensory stimulation. And uh, there's a few businesses in town that do that. We have a we jumpy have a place big, um, in the mall. Yeah. yeah. And it's like all inflatables and all that stuff. Same thing. Lower lower uh, music, um, no strobe lights and things like yeah, that. A, it's, um, it's great. What's it called? There's basically, it's like this big all-in cool place like that. They have putt-putt. They have everything inside, go-karts, whatever. And la I think it was last year someone told us that they actually now are doing um, a sensory autism day like twice or two times a year. Twice or three times a year. <laughs> yeah, that's I know how great. to count. I do. But um, <laughs> yeah, they because they were like, they have all the lights on and they actually have, um, especially in like the go-kart areas, extra padding for in the helmet. So if a kid wants to stand and watch, they can have a helmet on or earmuffs so that's not too loud. So like oh, they implemented a ton of stuff and this place is massive. Right. And I know one friend that went and she was like, I was blown away. They actually did it well. Cause she's like, yeah, and it was easy for me to find yeah. stuff in my area. Yeah. I just, um, if you just Google sensory sensitive events near me, yeah. um, autism speaks is one of the things that'll come up, but they have good resources as far as letting you know where to get things, where, yeah. where to access things like that. But I just found local businesses that had that on their social media Smaller and stuff like that. So, yeah. Really so if, if you just Google that, mm -hmm. um, holiday, sensory sensitive holiday events and sensory sensitive events near me. And I've found a ton of stuff. So if you're, you know, trying to consider, and like you mentioned, if there's nobody locally doing it, and there's a group of you that want it and want yeah. to participate or patronize a business, let them know, Hey, look, yeah. you know, on a day that things are slow, you can yeah. open two hours early and make yeah. a little and extra money and accommodate I think this us. This is like a dry run for the Nutcracker because Fridays are usually I'm excited not about their that. huge performance, but it being in the day, I'm like, I think this is like a dress rehearsal for you guys, but you're like, That's hey, probably, we'll yeah, it's you a know? good idea, it's really. Like, hey, why not? Yeah. Yeah. It is a good yeah. idea. But it's so hard if, too. If you're able to go, let us know. Take yeah. some pictures and stuff. Um, I don't know let, us, let us. 
I'll have to oh, that's Last true. Time we but went there, like, anyway, photos. let us know so you can report back. And then maybe what we'll do is interview them earlier in the year, next year, if they're doing we it could again. We could try, yeah. And, and that'd be cool. So, all right. Well, you found a lot of cool stuff for our contest. So we have six awesome baskets that we're going to be giving away. So keep an eye on that. Facebook and Instagram is where that um, contest will be airing. And then I'm going to let Ann go. Wait, actually, no, I'm not, because I'm going to tell the folks about what they can get today for, for oh, yes, what yes, today's, yes. because yes. I want, cool. I'm going to show it to people. And you have one of these coming for you. We bought one of these for you. And I know you're excited about it. I wish you would have got it before we did this. So, <laughs> oh, I know. So, I was thinking that too. I was like, this would have been awesome to have, but yeah. So today's, if you're watching on YouTube right now, what I want you to do is go to the comment section and just comment hashtag pledge 59. And if you do that from now until Monday, December 16th at 10 a.m., and then I'm going to run my random comment picker for the contest winner. And we have last year, last week's winner, um, she won a bottle of neural balance capsules so that was last week's winner christine that was her comment that we used our randomized uh winner picker so that we could what well, you you were trying to read and i, I caught you that's it. hilarious I like, oh, I don't think I uh, that's so funny there's my nose i could yeah. i should have looked down there too but i didn't even look <laughs> Uh, but anyway, so that's last week's winner. So, but this week's contest I'm excited about because it's over $400 worth of stuff. So here's now our, we support Autism Hope Alliance. We're silver sponsors, super silver sponsors, awesome silver sponsor. I don't know, something silver sponsors. And they have an, ish, an, an initiative going on right now called Pledge 59. And the idea is that one in 59 children have autism. Oh, it won't all fit. So I'm going to have to do the solo thing so I can fit this in there. So there we go. One in 59 children has autism. So Autism Hope Alliance is doing, they started this last Tuesday, Giving Tuesday. But uh, if you comment pledge, hashtag pledge 59 right now, in the comments from right now till December 16th at 10 a.m. And then we'll do our randomized um, picker and we'll get, we'll, oh, my, my autofocus went crazy there for yeah, a second. And then we'll do the random uh, picker and then we'll contact you directly and let you know who, who won. But here's the thing. This is what you're going to win, okay? So this costs us a $59 pledge to Autism Hope Alliance, but... You will get to choose, the winner will get to choose from box A or box B. Each one contains over $400 worth of uh, goods. So you have clean, good, healthy, autism-approved supplements, food, flour, different things. Uh, there's some, you know, no fluoride toothpaste and some different things in there. I'm trying to see with my old eyes, uh, but there's some really good products in there too. Probulin is a great product. Hemp Fusion, really good product. Uh, Barleen's Omega-3s, tasty, clean, uh, just some really good products. So either box A or box B, both of them are over $400 dollars in value. So what you do, you're watching right now on YouTube, right? So go in the comment section and just comment hashtag pledge 59. And we're going to let that run from now until Monday, December 16th at 10 a.m. And then we will run our little random comment picker and we'll let you know that you won and we'll uh, make accommodations for you to choose the box that you want and, and get everything sent to you. So there you go. Sense. Yours is well, on maybe, the way. I was going to say, maybe next show I could even pull it out. Like, and yes. Show, like, Actually, oh, by then you stuff. will. By next, because yeah. I think you'll probably get it by the end of this week. I think it shipped <laughs> so yesterday. Excited. So, I'm yeah. Excited. So you chose box A, right? Why yes. box A over box B? Um, there was more food stuff in box B. My guys don't do very good with oats very often. So okay. there was more food stuff in box B that I'm like, we've tried before and they've not necessarily liked so right. that's why i went with box a because i was like oh most of this stuff my guys love yes right so, right good yes, products good excited. products 
I love I right. love their organization too. Oh yeah, Autism I get of their Lies. emails. Yes. I just uh, talked with Kristen yesterday. We're gonna do if uh, this is thing too. You got you guys got to go to YouTube and subscribe. You just have to. Yes. There's a link in the description of the video. You click on that and it just confirms the subscription and you just hit the confirm button. And the reason I say that is on the seventeenth. We're doing uh, a thing with Kristen. We're, we're, we're interviewing Kristen Gonzalez from Autism Hope Alliance, and we are going to match, listen, we're going to match five pledges, five. So during the show, up to a certain cutoff date, like we'll do here, we'll announce it during the show. If you pledge, if you pledge $59 and you get a box, we're going to send you a second box free. So we're going to match five pledges during Yay. that show. So definitely subscribe to us on YouTube so that you can keep abreast of all that stuff and uh, share. So, yeah. and thank you so much for all Yay. your hard work and for thinking of uh, when I didn't think about the gift basket. <laughs> like we have to do a and, giveaway. We have yeah, to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So uh, I appreciate you try you, you pitched it last year, and I was like, "That's great!" And then I didn't do anything. And so then you're like, "Oh, yeah, it's December." I have so to do like, stuff. Yeah. That's right. It's too late. So now, though, you took the bull by the horns and uh, and went ahead and did it. I appreciate oh. that. So we're excited. So look. If you're watching, look, Facebook and Instagram, follow us both places because that's where the contest for the six different gift baskets is going to be running. And then watch us on YouTube. And right now, comment, pl hashtag pledge, pledge 59, and we'll do the random picker, comment picker, and you'll win one of those awesome boxes over $400 worth of product. So, and Thank you so much for joining us. Yes, it's bad to talk. We'll talk and soon, and the rest of us will see you next Thursday at 9.30 Eastern sounds Standard great. Time. Yeah, Have a good sounds one. good. Bye. Bye-bye. All right. You know, Anne is awesome. She has helped me out so much over the years, helped us out, um, given us advice. Uh, she's our social media warrior. I, I unleash her on social media so that she can offer good advice and help out. Um, she helps in the group. She helps on our Facebook page. And then she's just out there in the internets. Um, the wild world wide web of the internet, um, giving advice and support and helping people out answering questions. And we always appreciate everything that she does for moms and for us. So I'm going to take this ticker down because it's distracting me, but don't forget we have this awesome contest today's Thursday night watch comment and win prize is one of these boxes with a value of over four hundred dollars and these are all autism approved and what this is it's a pledge for the autism hope alliance so we pledged 59 dollars and we get one of these boxes worth over four hundred dollars and we're going to give that box to the one lucky person who our random comment picker chooses. So right now, you have from now until Monday, December 16th at 10 a.m. From now between then, comment hashtag pledge 59 and you will be entered to win this one of, the, one of these awesome boxes with a $400 value. So comment, share, and of course, subscribe and hit that bell on YouTube. So every Thursday night when we do this giveaway, um, you'll know what's going on. So we have, I have one last announcement that I want to give you before we go. And it's, if you're watching this after January 1st, 2020, then it doesn't really apply to you. But if you're watching here, December, uh, between December, between December now and December 31st, 2019, then this does apply to you. We have a couple changes 
not with our, um, we're not raising prices, but we are going to change our discount structure just a little bit. And the reason we're doing that is we have some raw material costs that have gone up. And in the past, we've always absorbed that increase. And we are going to do that again this year. We're not raising prices and we still offer free shipping. The difference is our Amazon price is going from $51.96 to $54.96. And our subscription price is also going from $51.96 to $54.96. So it's not not a raise in price, but it is a difference in the discount structure. But we uh, have done something to help you with that. If you go to neuralbalance.com and you click on any, any of the products, uh, the Neural Balance capsules or the Neural Balance neural balance powder, you'll see that there's two options. You can purchase one at full price, $64.95, or you can sign up for the subscription for $51.96. If you sign up for the subscription between now and December 31st, 2019, you will be grandfathered in at the $51.96 price as long as your subscription remains active. So when our subscription changes, as I just mentioned, starting January 1st, 2020, when the Amazon price and the subscription price changes from $51.96 to $54.96, if you have already gone to Neural Balance and subscribed at the $51.96 price, you will be grandfathered in. So if you're currently on the subscription, then this discount change does not affect you. If you sign up for the subscription between now and December 31st, 2019, you will be grandfathered in and that change on Amazon and with our subscription will not affect you. So now's the time to do it. Go to Neural Balance, su subscribe now for that $51.96 price. And I'm going to mention this one more time before I get going because I really want you guys to have the opportunity to win this. Uh, what, we were, what we're doing is if you are watching on YouTube, this only works on YouTube, comment hashtag pledge 59 from now until Monday, December 16th at 10 a.m. 2019, and you'll be entered to win either box A or box B. So once we run our uh, random comment checker, we will contact the winner. They can choose the box and we'll get it on the way. But there's over a $400 value in products in each box. So you can enter to win that absolutely free. All you have to do is put a comment in the comment section, hashtag pledge 59, and you'll be entered to win. So I would definitely take advantage of that. It's, it's a great deal, great products, and it's a good opportunity. So take advantage of it. All right. And we just want to thank you for joining us for this episode of the Spectrum Report. As always, the Spectrum Report is brought to you by Neural Balance with Anandinol. You can learn more about Anandinol. It's a patented herbal vitamin mineral blend by going to our website, neuralbalance.com, clicking on the How It Works tab. Like and follow us on Facebook. As a matter of fact, just Google us. YouTube, Twitter, Periscope, Facebook, Instagram. We're having a contest starting this coming week on Facebook and Instagram. And as I said, you can uh, comment on YouTube right now through Monday, December 16th. Uh, comment hashtag pledge 59 to be entered to win over $400 worth of product from Autism Hope Alliance sponsors. So we do Thank you for joining us today. And if you have any other questions, you can shoot us an email at support at neuralbalance.com. We'd be happy to send you information, links to our website, our Facebook group, and all that good stuff. If you have any specific questions, um, that's also a good place to go. But then I can't emphasize enough the importance of our Facebook group. So search Neural Balance Support Group on Facebook and ask to join. We um, always appreciate people tuning in, ask that you share this show so that other people can benefit from this great content and subscribe to us on YouTube so you don't miss out on anything in the future. Have a great day. Thanks for joining us.
Because of neurobalance, my daughter can sleep through the night consistently, which hasn't happened in years, and we are so thankful.